Hi guys, my name is Gurushki and welcome to my beautiful channel. This is your daily tarot reading for Thursday, July 20th, 2017. Um, we're going to get right into this reading. I'm trying to keep up with these daily readings again, you guys. Um, so there's very good news in your atmosphere. Very, 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 very good news, my guys are saying. Um, they want to... <laughs> I'm. They're not even letting me get into the reading without channeling but um keep in mind this is a general reading if you want something more specific to you and your energy you can book a reading with me in the detail box below all right so they're saying very good news is in your atmosphere sudden change is near they want to um direct your attention onto um a soulmate union so there could be someone coming to you quite suddenly here um, are they, are they just saying sudden change, sudden change is near? Um, they keep repeating that. Um, so it could be something that's completely out of your control that is taking place, an event, um, something that is divinely orchestrated, um, happening behind the scenes, something that could just pop up out of the blue or something that is already taking place. Um, but it has something to do with your soul, a soulmate union. So you could be pulling someone in, you could... It could be someone showing up just out of the blue to assist you in your journey and, and um, assisting you and helping you um, to where you need to go. Um, a lot of you guys are considering traveling and school at this time. They're, those are like your two biggest things at the moment. Um, I do feel whatever you're going through, um, whatever big life changes you're trying to make at this time, there is someone that will assist you. Um, my guys are just encouraging you, encouraging you to get out and explore a new terrain. Um, I do feel like since some of you decided to be open to miracles and things of that nature, um, having faith will allow these people and places and things to draw to you. Um, instead of resisting, embrace, embrace it, embrace the you know new terrain, going new places. Also, embracing your sexuality is still coming up. So, it's something, if you're very intuitive, it's something that your guides have been telling you telling you to do to, in order to embrace your sexuality. Whether it's getting nipple piercings, whether it's getting belly piercings, whether it's, um, you know, <laughs> wearing skimpier, quote-unquote, clothes. Or just, like, bralettes for, for females. Um, or just admiring your body in the mirror, um naked things like that flirting <laughs> things like that um but they definitely keep bringing someone to mind for a crush like i've been getting in my latest reading someone who is blonde um blonde hair blue eyes um but this person has a big is a big deal maybe so they could probably be a professional athlete they probably could be um someone well known um they can come off uh, something of that nature. So if you guys resonate with that, you may you may have already some know someone in your atmosphere of that nature. Um, but there's definitely someone who stands out to you at this time. Um, the word BMX also comes up, so it could be something in that in a sporting atmosphere like that. Um, I do feel like this person owns a red car, so I don't know. They could have something to do with um, your adventures elsewhere. Um, a lot of you guys um, are thinking of reasons to stay committed to someone. Um, but maybe you're feeling bored in the relationship and you kind of like want a way out. Um, but it's really up to you. Um, some of you guys need self-exploration, so some of you guys... Um, are really considering leaving a re leaving a relationship in this discontent and boredom card. Um, and I feel your guys are saying do what makes you happy. Um, whether it's cutting t make uh cutting tie ties with people, um, <laughs> that no longer serve you or a city that you don't no longer want to you no longer want to live in. But definitely, if you have somewhere to travel in mind, it's time to go. It's time to pick up and leave. I feel like it's, it's a lot of you guys want to pick up and leave in general um, and go somewhere new. Could be vacationing. Could be um, just going somewhere totally new for, <laughs> new for uh, a living situation. Um, 
see what else you guys be positive at this time because again there's a new home in order for you you probably don't know how this home's going to come about it's kind of going to it's kind of going to pop up in your face like maybe someone will offer you the keys to a new condo type thing or something um but or someone probably has a spare room room for you to stay um but there's definitely something positive cooking up in your atmosphere right now if you've been struggling or having a hard time um there's someone around in your atmosphere to help you um so be positive um remain humble and like be you be free um i feel like you have no worries like nothing to worry about like hakuna matata has been coming up a lot um, because I feel like the universe is just working for you. I feel like you probably have people or negative people who want to tear you down. But again, that song Shining Beyonce is because you're the light, I feel. You have a lot going for you, whether you realize it or not. And I think there's people who realize certain things about you that you didn't even know yourself. But you're really shining at this time. Um, but I do feel like you will have stable income and a stable foundation. If you've been wanting to work at like an aquarium or somewhere new, go ahead and do so by all means. Because you could need a change in career or a change in like identity in a sense. Um, you are going somewhere new pretty sudden here, pretty shortly. Because um, that gives me a packing your bags and leaving on a whim. Um, could be going on a trip. Again, <laughs> sorry you guys for Maui has been coming up. I'm an awful lot, so um, I just get you. Could, you could be going there quite suddenly. Sudden, sudden changes near. Sudden changes near. They keep saying. Um, some of you guys will probably feel guilty for leaving or um, for moving out somewhere new or branching out or um, leaving a situation that no longer no longer serves you. It's always this fear of loss or um, maybe it's just. Um, You'll be healing from cutting ties from the past and getting over a karmic cycle. Um, but it's just an energy of starting a new, like new friends. And there's something really about a crush with blonde hair. <laughs> um, let me ask my guys to like clarify. I can pull an extra card too. Okay, so this person could be a potential suitor. But this person, let's see what they say about the person with blonde hair. I'm going to ask them. What should we know about this person with blonde hair? Okay, so this person could be your soulmate. Um, but this person could also have tattoos. So if you also if you have anything in mind like that, um, and it resonates, let me know how that goes. But maybe this person who seeks to see you today, or um, just <laughs> they really they really admire you. But I don't know if they know how to like speak up and talk to you really. Um. They may not know how to approach you or they may not know how to like come at you. <laughs> I do feel like they play the cool guy role a lot. So um, you may have to bring them down a notch or like or like be assertive, um, be yourself. Um, <laughs> I feel like I picture someone just like holding a man by the shoulders and like, look, I like you. This is how it's going to go. This is this. Like basically... Um, you having to take lead um but yeah this new person probably will help you get get to where you need to go i feel like it's saying so you could be seeing them next time you and you're out doing your hobby or some kind of sporting event um the bike is also coming up so bmx rider it could be very well known famous um but yeah, explore different culture, explore different terrain. New love is here. True love is here. So it could be a soulmate union um, going on or happening right now. Um, be open. Be dope. Be you. Um, unapologetically. All right, you guys. Hope you like that reading. Peace.